Hey, hey, hey guys, my name is Ronan Gaming, and uh, today we have a very special episode. Now, as you see, my frame rates aren't that good, and they're splitting between uh, 10 and 40, and that is because we are playing on our very first modded survival series. I did not know I had Optifine with this, but I had to start with a bonus chest because this modded survival series be a little more difficult than other series that you might see around uh, the internet. Uh, this is a mod pack called Fossils and Archaeology. Uh, I do play on a server. Uh, it's called Moon uh, Play dot Mooncraft Modded dot Fun. I'm pretty sure. Uh, if you guys want to go check out the Discord server, it will be in the description below. I am a moderator on there. I will say hi to you. Uh, but Today, this is a modded survival series. Uh, very interesting. Obviously, frame rates are not going to be that good during this. Uh, when I use Optifine Zoom, I get around 50, but then I get back and start sprinting and I get 10. And my in game FPS is not that good either. So, yeah, let's just go find a spot where we can make our little base. And I quickly just want to mention yes, I am using the Technic Launcher to, r to run this version. Uh, I don't like using Forge just by its own. I want to try to find some fossils to show you what they look like, but I'm not sure I'm able to find them right now. Oh, here, yeah, this is what they look like, and you need iron tools to get at them. I only have wood. Let's actually mine up some stone. It's gonna be like, it's gonna be your normal, typical, uh, Minecraft adventure, but, um, it's gonna be a lot different because it's modded. So I'm just finishing up some of the iron I have. I did just make an iron pick. And I have not made a door yet. Just, just place the crack to Just getting some coal here. And we found more iron. And now I can show you what happens when you mine at fossils. This is where they there's one. Oh, yes! Biofossil. Very first one. That's amazing. That's perfect. Another biofossil. Plant fossil. I, I have started... I, I do know a little bit about this. It's not like I'm a noob or anything. I know how to craft some things. But not all of them. <laughs> it's the only problem. Go back into our little base. So we can't really use this yet until we get... Um, Use some of this dark oak. More sticks. Well, I'm gonna try to make an analyzer. I don't know what I need. Uh, analyzer will scan this and stuff. Uh, I wish. I wish. Modded stuff also show up showing up in here. So I'm just gonna go into the fandom and check how to create it. So I need a stone tablet to make it. That means we have to go mining some more. Um hopefully I can find one soon. And we'll start getting my dinos. Jeez. Oh my gosh, there are a bunch of creepers in here. Okay, wow, that was really bad. I need more armor. I barely have any food, I only have apples. <laughs> not this, not this. Oh, why don't, wait, why don't I have a sword? Stone tablet, there we go. Okay, let's go. Ah, nope, let's go. 
it is also starting to become nighttime a little bit, so we have to be wary or wary of the situations that we are in right now. But anyways, let me try to craft this. Look at that. Sturgeon. Yes, we get raw fish. I'll gladly eat that. I'll have a creeper for me walking. Okay, we have an analyzer, by the way, guys, now. Which is awesome. Uh, still no door on my house. Just realized that. Yeah. There we go. Uh, so grab the analyzer. And we just chuck him in. And we just wait for it to finish. It's that simple. Another thing that I'd like to point out with this is that you can create little dinosaurs. Mm. Oh, that's Spinosaurus. Those are my favorite dinosaurs. Come on. That's a chicken. Where's the Spinosaurus? Oh my gosh, no. I'm gonna break this block before I get to Spinosaurus. Okay, I just pause the video and then I come back at, at the first thing I place. It's about a source. Look at that chin. Anyways, so we have coal, but we also have fossilized horse tail seed. So the rest of those in there, maybe get some DNA. And then we need a bucket of milk, milk and a culture vat, which you need cactus green for. Okay, so we got two sand from one of them. Bone meal. I mean, this is an infinite source of bone meal, too. Mm. Ah! Gotta go mining for some more. Okay, so we are back from a long mine trip. I went down there a little bit in the dark because I didn't have any torches and I mined some stuff, went over there, and got a couple of things. And we also have this thing, uh, Dominican Amber. I don't know what it's used for, but. Yes, yeah, so we'll throw that in and see if we get a DNA. So far, sand and bone meal. More sand. Alligator guard DNA. I'm not too shabby, but I want dinosaur DNA. Alligator guards are still alive nowadays. One more fossil, please, something. All I've been getting is DNA. I mean, uh, bone meal. DNA, DNA, DNA. To a plant eater, please. Bone meal! Ugh! Come on, come on, come on, come on, I just got a little bit more gravel. Yeah. <laughs> but, haha, I tricked ya. We got Stegosaurus DNA out of one of them. Yes! Stegosaurus DNA. Can't do anything with it yet, but... Finally! Now, this one, this uh, might just end the episode here, honestly. A little short beginning to our adventure. Might do some off cam culture vat creation and try not to kill myself in the meantime. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you guys are new, consider subscribing and uh, liking the video if you guys did enjoy this. And I'll uh, see you guys in the next one. Uh, wait. See you on the flip side. Bye.